I am Assassin One JRS once again, and this is the next part of my Until Dawn playthrough. So obviously, in the last video, it's been kind of a slow burn uh, so far in this game, but uh, things start picking up at, towards the end of this video. So look forward to that. Uh, currently, we are looking for well, we're looking to turn the water on because it's currently off. So a meaning, meaningless task, but we, you know, we have to do it in this game, unfortunately. So yeah. I hope you enjoy the rest of this video, look forward to a bit of action at the end, uh, it gets interesting, and I hope to see you next time. Those things are a joke, man. Don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time. Me and... Well... Hey, Josh, no hot water's kind of a major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um... Okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric <laughs> ward before Chris makes a move. Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... <sighs> what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this. Together. Um... I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Here, can you, can you hold this? Shine it here so I can see what I'm doing.
Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Ah, oh, damn. It's okay. I'm just try again. Not that hard. Just press the button when the light comes on. Okay, okay, okay. I'll get it this time. Oh, damn. It's okay. I'm just try again. Oh my god. Don't move. What? Something behind you. Yeah, right. Josh. Seriously. There's something back there. <laughs> I gotcha. All right, all right, your point. Dirty love. What? No. Where'd you get the first point? Doesn't start at 30? No, 15. Oh. Oh, more of a ping pong now. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, okay, so you hear that too, right? Josh. What? I said I'm just weirdly regular. Not, not, nothing regular about it. Maybe we should go check it out. Why? What if it's like a, a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor to it. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh! What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. 
<laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Boyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyoyo
What's so important in the bag, anyways? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, hell, we don't need those. You don't want me to model them for you? I'm just gonna rip them off, anyways. Maybe I want to show them off. Puts me in a generous mood. Let's go get them. Kisser on this thing, dare to put your hand in it. Day, hey, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in there. Ah! <gasps> Emily! Emily! <laughs> gotcha, big dip. Jesus, you're ridiculous. Oh, come on. What was that? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably just an animal or... Do not like. Madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. not there before. Is that a note? Oh. Uh... It's gotta be Chris. Or Josh. They're just trying to mess with us. Kind of uncool, guys. I don't like this. Me neither. Oh! Dad! What the hell's going on? did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed. I'd like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? Hmm. Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game, now is it? Let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person, loyalty or honesty? So, you would tell the truth even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty, then, and charity? <laughs> G 
Charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? Oh, well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Okay. Um, is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Who are you? Oh, oh here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Who's sister? Oh, come on, is this for real? Shut up. Ask it who's sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Who are we speaking to? Hannah? Is that you? Oh, God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. Anna, we miss you. And we want to know what happened to you. Can you, can you tell us what happened? B? <sighs> E T R. Uh, I don't like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Uh, it's still going. Oh God. K I L L E D. No. Killed. We didn't kill them. It was just a prank. A Ash, calm, calm down. Okay, just we, we, we need to find out more. I'm sorry. I am so guys, guys, sorry. What, what, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. Okay. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library B here? B? R? O? O? Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library? What the? You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, look, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board. Hey, hey calm down. It's it's not actually. I don't need fault. this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Shh. 
Should we go after him? Ah, man, I... I mean, he'll be okay. Let's... Let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. If, if, if you were faking it, you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Yes? Jess? Jess? Hey, Jess? Buddy, you in there? Good blue out of my jeans. <laughs> what the hell is that doing in there anyway? I totally promise I won't murder you when I find you. Oh! Oh my, oh my God. No. <laughs> that was so good. Not, no. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You had to see this. You had to I'm not like, seeing no, it. No. No. no, no, no. <laughs> you recorded that? Uh, look at your face. <laughs> I was scared, oh Jed. You can't just no. jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the that woods. It's so scary. Good. I'm sorry. Don't no. scare you. If you send that to anybody, I'm Do what? gonna kill you. <laughs> no, 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 I'm gonna see this thing. Oh, where's the delete button? Is this it here? No, 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 no. It's not funny. It's not funny. But you look so cute when you're scared. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you're strapped in. If you're about to feel the full force of my mind, that's real good. Well, well, well. Look at this fun little lovebird carving. An M and an E. Any idea what that could stand for? Oh, could be any, you know, Elizabeth and, and Myron. <laughs> or maybe Michael and Emily? Relax. I just didn't realize you were so sappy. Pun intended. I may look like a tough and rugged, manly man on the exterior, but deep down, I'm in touch with my feelings. I'm not afraid to show a little affection now and again. Oh, yeah? You gonna show me some affection later? Girl, all kinds of affection. Oh, is that a check I can cash? Wink. <laughs> Let's go, Casanova.
like a real winter wonderland out here now. Hey, girl, you know I hooked you up. Mm hmm. Was it someone screaming? No. No. Uh, probably just a squirrel or something. Creep town. <laughs> Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. Not sure I want to know. It's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon.
Seriously? I just... I froze. I don't know. Mike, you're a big boy. You gotta think on your feet. Yeah, of course, Jed. I... I you need new pants? What? Well, you pooped all over those. Yes. No, no, for real. Don't turn out like that on me again, homeboy. Not attractive. Oh. Holy crap, I feel like I just ran a marathon. I think we kind of did. Was it a bear? Yeah, it's gotta be. Things are crazy fast. I mean, I didn't see it. Hey, things are not gonna come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay, well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is gonna open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Wow. We don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. My yeah. fire and mood lighting. Yes, my lady. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. Shit. Fuck, Mike. What? Oh, crap. What? Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone, okay? Just slow down. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can't find it? Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. Oh, shit. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay, okay. Well, I'll help you look for it. It's gotta be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. Fine. Looky, looky. Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? Man one, fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? I think... Well, I, I wish we had some booze. Uh, well, uh, if I'd known that ahead of time. I don't know. I'm kind of just... I'm not feeling it yet. Am I doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean, I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's, it's not your fault. Uh, Jess, I really like you. Whoever you think I am, well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. Well, I am liking your confidence. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please. 
There's just no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Jess, really, it's fine. <laughs> I really don't like it. Oh, shutter it. Shutters are shutted. Now, where were we? I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to, like, keep this up and... What? Keep, keep what up? Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I'm really kind of insecure. You've got to be kidding me. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh. <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. You're just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah. I guess I do. Yeah. And that's super fucking hot. Really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. Come here. Maybe I know how to handle you too. I am definitely ready to be handled. It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know. It just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake. God damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business.
Do you really think the girls were communicating with us? I don't know. I don't know if I wish they were or if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. 